Okay, now we have a new software for the Powerwall and Server Rack batteries. Now we are going to switch on the new software and check how to use and what is the difference between the old and new software. To be clear that uh, both software are working, only the difference is the interface. Okay, the new software version is HS2.0.3. The wire is connected, I'm going to connect. So you have all the same information here. You have the voltage uh, differential there. Uh, you can also see what is the protocol here, uh, address. And uh, from the system, system configuration, you can see which uh, in inverter protocol is using here. Okay. Uh, as you can see here, it's a pylon CAN and the pylon RS485. Mm, here has a password. You can uh, here you can, uh, for example, you change to uh, Victron. Where's Victron? 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 Great. Uh, sorry, Victron. All right, you cannot write. You need the password. Uh, if you want to use a new software, you can contact us to get the password for the uh, uh, inverter protocol changeover password. And for the parameter settings, the password is another one. Um, you can also contact us to get them. And you can just uh, simply leave us a comment to YouTube or just uh, or you can send us the email sales at opsolarbattery.com uh, you can rate okay it's succeed uh, just read to verify okay now it's a uh, big strong can okay i'll change back to pattern can uh, right read okay now remove the password okay this is this, this function and um, uh, uh same uh if you want to change the parameters uh, read all okay now this is setting now there's no arm we will do a test for a uh, change the uh, setting and write the parameters to check the alarms, to test use some of the functions of these uh, new apps. Uh, the password, you can contact us, send us email, salesopsolarbattery.com to get it, or just uh, send us a comment on YouTube. Okay, now you are able to uh, write all, write all. Okay, just read to verify. Okay, now we are going to write all the parameters down. Just be aware that all the parameters uh, in front of the parameters, there's one checkbox. If the checkbox is not clicked, the parameter will not write down. Just now we did show that um, after we read all, it's not uh, changed the parameter. Uh, we will try to write down again with the checkbox uh, check marked. And we will set as uh, 3.26 to test the alarm. Right all. Right all. Okay. And then I uncheck mark this. Uh, now, uh, now it's uh, after read it's um, enabled, so there should have alarm. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, sixteen. And uh, we're going to uncheck it, uncheck it, right all. Read all. Okay, now we're going to see there's no alarm. This uh, function we have tested in an uh, older uh, apps, so we also do the test here. So all the parameters, uh, before you write down, the check mark box should be checked. Otherwise, the protection function will not be there.
If you have any doubts who use the apps, you contact us anytime.